for Jay Cashman. And I'm Shannon Cake. Your New Year's resolution is to lose a few pounds, at least for some people. You don't need to. I wasn't looking at you when I was saying it. But a new study reveals the extra fat may be good for your health. I have to run a lot to keep it that way. News Channel 5's Tanya Rogers live in West Palm Beach with more Tanya. We are live at the Fitness Edge in West Palm Beach where people are working out behind me. Maybe you're one of those that actually goes and works out every day. Or maybe you just got a gym membership because we know it's the beginning of the year and that means New Year's resolutions. Now, tomorrow morning when you wake up on News Channel 5, between the hours of 5 a.m. and 7 a.m., you will see 15 different commercials talking about exercise, dieting, getting in shape, or actually watching what you eat. But could a new study change your mind about hitting the gym? Is it okay to be overweight? A study was just released by the Journal of the American Medical Association. The association studied 3 million adults considered overweight or obese. The results being heavy doesn't shorten your life. And people are already weighing in on the study. Uh, it's surprising. Might give people to interpret that a license to eat more. Your body needs to have a buffering effect if you're, if you're having some stresses in your life. Registered dietitian Stacy Silver says this latest study was based on body mass index or BMI between 25 and 30. They're basically saying that people who are overweight may not be at risk for premature death. However, BMI does not take into account other factors such as lean body mass. So you might have somebody who has more muscle and less fat, and they, which makes them weigh a little bit differently than someone who would have maybe more fat. Stacy says there is more than just focusing on your BMI. Instead, focus on healthy lifestyle changes diabetes, cardiovascular disease. Um, it does not take into account family history, so what you might be predisposed to. It's still important to take into account lifestyle changes. Now, most people that we spoke with today say they still love to exercise no matter what this new study says. Others told us they're really not going to change anything, but they would actually like to see more done on this study on other individuals to see what the results are. In the end, the dietitian said moderation in everything. Reporting live, Tanya Rogers, WPTV News Channel 5. Yeah, that brings